The Relative Strength Index is one of the most popular technical analysis indicators. It can help traders identify overbought and oversold conditions in a securities price action, the direction of the current trend, and more. While the RSI indicator is a useful tool for traders, it also has some weaknesses that should not be ignored. Those weaknesses are mainly related to false signals and limited effectiveness in trending markets. So instead of using the old RSI, we can consider a different, more advanced alternative. This tool is called the Easy Algo Oscillator V3. I backtested it on a crypto market in combination with other indicators and the results were really impressive. The Easy Algo Oscillator V3 is a technical analysis tool that measures the momentum of price movements in financial markets. It is designed to provide traders with information on whether an asset is overbought or oversold and whether a potential trend reversal is likely to happen. It uses mathematical formulas to generate numerical values within a range between 0 and 100. The main parts of the indicator are the overbought and oversold zones which are displayed as red and blue areas, the wave trend which depending on a price direction can be bullish or bearish, and the buy and sell signals which are the core of the oscillator. The indicator also comes with volume bars. They can be bullish or bearish as well. A buy signal occurs when the wave trend switches from bearish to bullish after it has entered the oversold zone. Exactly the opposite is true for a sell signal. Okay, now we have a general idea of how this oscillator functions. So how can we create the best strategy with it? First, open the indicators and search for the tool named Kirill Channel. The creator is Gassan of Kirill. Then open its settings and change the first border offset to 2, the second border offset set to 0.2 and the third one to 0.5. Then head over to the style and hide the border top 1 and the border bottom 1 lines. The Kirill channel is an indicator that helps traders identify volatility as well as the overbought and oversold zones. It is based on the annual Ligu moving average or ALMA, Fibonacci retracement and the Keltner channel. The way this indicator works is very simple. When the price approaches the lower green bands, this can be considered as a potential buying opportunity. When the price approaches the red bands, this can be a good opportunity to sell the security. The Kirill channel and the Easy Algo oscillator work very well together because of their similar nature. However, there is still one piece missing. Can you guess what it is? I will give you a clue. It has something to do with the trend. You see, our current system does not work when the market is strongly trending in any direction. It is because it's not in our favor to trade against the prevailing sentiment. Our goal is to catch tops in a downtrend and bottoms in an uptrend but not the opposite. So how can we filter out all these fake signals and leave only the good ones? Well, all we need to do is to add a 200 smooth moving average to the chart. Be sure to adjust its settings as I'm doing right now. A smoothed moving average is a type of moving average used in trading that is designed to reduce the impact of short-term price fluctuations and provide a clearer picture of the long-term trend in financial markets. It is a type of indicator that takes into account past price data and provides an average value that smooths out fluctuations in price. Smoothed MAs are used to identify potential trends in the market and to confirm potential price reversals. When the price of an asset is trading above the smoothed moving average, it is considered a bullish signal, while trading below the SMA is considered a bearish signal. In the strategy I'm about to show you, we will take into account the position of the SMA against the Kirill channel as well. So let's break down the exact conditions for a long trade. First, the price must be closed above the SMA. Second, the Kirill channel must also be positioned above the moving average. Third, the price needs to pull back into the lower green bands. We need to make sure that we buy on a dip. Lastly, to confirm a long trade, the Easy Algo Oscillator must print a blue dot. Remember, all the conditions must be met at the time the Easy Algo gives a signal. If the rules are met, place a buy order at the close of the price bar. Set the stop loss below the recent swing low. If you trade on lower timeframes such as 1, 3 or 5 minutes, be sure to leave sufficient room for the price to breathe. Once the price has moved in your direction and the risk reward ratio is 1 to 1, adjust the stop loss to the break even level. When the price reaches 2 to 1 risk reward, secure half the profit. Keep doing that until your stop loss gets triggered or the easy algo oscillator prints a red dot. Remember, do not set any profit targets for the strategy. 
Here's another example for a long trade. This one is a bit different. So we see the price break below the channel, yet it remained above the SMA. And the question is, can we still take this long trade? Of course we can. As long as the price remains above the SMA, we can take a long trade. Just wait for the easy algo oscillator to give you a buy confirmation. Alright, now let's learn the conditions for short trades. First, make sure the market is in a downtrend. This is confirmed by the position of the price against the SMA. Second, the Kirill channel must be positioned below the SMA at a time of entry. Third, the price needs to pull back into the channel's overbought zone before the easy algo oscillator issues a sell signal. Place a sell order at the close of the candlestick. Set the stop loss above the recent swing high. Apply the same money management rules as for long trades. With this strategy, you will be able to avoid the ranging market 9 times out of 10. It works super well for scalping and day trading stocks, forex and cryptocurrencies. The easy algo oscillator is definitely much better than a regular RSI. It is a premium indicator though. You can get access to it by signing up for a subscription on the Easy Algo official website. Along with Easy Algo oscillators, you will also get Easy Algo V6, which is a confirmation buy and sell indicator, and the Easy Algo SR. I made a video about those indicators too. If you haven't seen it yet, it's this one right here. Anyway, thanks for watching this video and see you in the next one.